guys, I just want to dish out a piece of advice to Africans living in the United Arab Emirates. Well, let me say to Dubai. If you are living in Dubai, my dear, you need to know the kind of places you visit. You need to know the time to visit and you need to know the kind of friends we keep. This is a strange land. This is my guys. I just want to dish out a piece of advice to Africans living in the United Arab Emirates. Well, let me say to Dubai. If you are living in Dubai, my dear, you need to know the kind of places you visit. You need to know the time to visit and you need to know the kind of friends we keep. This is a strange land. This is not our homeland. So there are rules, there are laws, and there are regulations of each country. Make sure you are familiar with those laws and regulations. Now, why am I saying this? You see, most of us at times we don't have parents here. Yeah? At times we don't even have friends that they can stand for us in time of situation. Now, yesterday I was talking on phone with a friend of mine and she said, Oh, Antoinette, I need to go for a friend birthday party. It was past 2 a.m. And I was like, Ah, it's very late. Why can't you just send your gift to this person the next day? And she said, Oh, Dubai is free, Dubai is safe, so I have my documents, I have to buy said, Okay. To my greatest surprise, she called me this evening and said, Antoinette, this is the situation as I went. Most of us were pick, and I was just fortunate to come back home. Now, this is her situation. In most cases, your case might be different. There are situations that even if you have all your documents and you are caught in certain places, my dear, you will be deported. We have many people that have gone back home for something they know nothing about. So I'm calling on all Africans in Dubai. If you are living in Dubai, my dear, know the kind of places you visit, know the time you visit, and know the friends you keep. It's like most of us, we don't understand that you are in this country alone. When you have problems, that is when you know you don't have friends, you don't have anyone to stand for you. So it's very important for us to be very careful the kind of things we do. Always like avoid the kind of crowding places because you see your friends are going this, you want to do this, you want to put expensive things, you want to go extra mile to do many things that are not necessary. In any country, there, there must be rules, there must be laws, and there must be regulation. You must be familiar to those laws so that in case of anything, you can defend yourself. But most of us at times, we don't know the laws, we don't know the regulation of that country. All we know is that, oh, I have my document, I have my visa, I have the right to go anywhere, I have the right to visit anywhere at any time. It's not called for. So I'm calling on all of us. We should know the way we do things, we should know how we visit people, and we should know the kind of friends we keep. You are in this country alone. Before you want to do something, make sure you team up your family back home. Some of you, you have wife back home, husband, kids, parents. They are very important to us. That is why we are here. So, my dear, be very careful. The kind of places you visit, the time you visit, and the kind of friends you keep is very important. I remain your baby girl for life. Stay blessed. Happy August. Bye. I feel like I'm losing my mind. Is everybody in the world blind? Please, Lord.